Hey guys, Tatiana here. And Fabio. And today's video, we're gonna show you all our travel gear setup. If you're new to our channel, we are traveling the world full time in the year 2020. We are literally going around the world. Or we might extend it to 2021 just to hit the Latin American country. We haven't booked a ticket yet, but we'll see. We'll find out. But today's video, we're going to show you all our travel setup. Um, currently, I'm filming with my iPhone because I want to show you the camera. So let's get started with that and you can switch later on. So first up, we have the camera. This is a very, by the way, this is a very cheap travel setup because everything is basic <laughs> our camera is probably one of the most basic vlogging camera it is the Canon M6 and that's what we've been using for two years now and we kind of like it we kind of don't it's okay what I don't like is it doesn't have 120 FPS for all you camera geeks out there it's only 60 FPS which is fine for slow motion it's not too slow-mo but it's slow motion it's whatever but it's very perfect really because it's so light and it's so easy to carry around the lens honestly is so heavy compared to the rest of the camera the body yes yes this but is not the original lens that came with it it's we bought an extra a new lens actually because this one is very wide it's 10 to 18 millimeters so that's what i like about this lens and to attach it to the camera body since it's a mirrorless camera we have the booster or whatever the extension the adapter, the adapter. <laughs> thank <laughs> you it's from it's by comlight we'll link everything down below attached to it we have this uh, awesome microphone honestly this makes the quality of your audio so much better yes and that's because with this muff you don't hear any background noise or the wind especially if you vlog outside and you're in a city crowded city or very noisy this is perfect it's a one directional microphone so it will only pick up the noise from this so when you're vlogging your voice will be picked up but behind it or on the side it won't pick up as much what's the great thing about this microphone as well is it doesn't have a battery it's you just literally have to plug it in your camera and forget it this is a road video micro by the way and the higher road microphones you have there's a battery you have to charge it you have to turn it, it turn it on so you can't just plug it and forget it right away so this what i like about this is you just plug it in and forget it and it will work so i'm gonna switch the camera now and we're gonna be using this camera with this combo oh just by the way we're gonna go into much detail here so obviously with the camera you need a SD card so I'm gonna switch so now we're using our vlogging camera with the microphone with a wide-angle lens and talking about lenses moving on we also have this lens this is probably the heaviest gear that we have in this setup so we we typically use this lens for b-rolls um this is the sigma 18 to 35 millimeter f 1.8 so it will stay at f 1.8 all the way through no matter how much zooming you do so it's perfect for cinematic shots and the blurry background and all that so honestly it's a beautiful beautiful lens yes. so if you have some spare money and you want to invest in it we highly recommend that one check out my review and my vlog test with this in our channel in this channel since it is a 1.8 lens it's a very wide so there's a lot of light coming in so we cannot use the 1.8 so what we did is we also bought this ND filter this is just for videos and it will help your camera it will it's pretty much like a sunglasses yeah sunglasses for your camera so we also obviously need a lot of batteries because when we are out in the streets for 10 hours a day then we need a lot of it and we yes. film a lot of stuff so we have these four batteries plus the one that is in the camera right now so yes, five, so five total. total yes so it's a it, lot of battery with that we obviously have our chargers chargers yeah mm -hmm. yeah and it has a cable that attaches to the wall so yeah. they're very cheap you guys you can find them on amazon the best thing about this as well is it's a usb charge so we can literally use our power bank which we're going to show you later to charge it in our bag while we go on the road obviously to transfer all our videos from the camera to the laptops we can use a uh, wireless so we can use the wi-fi or we have this amazing portal which yes fits a million different cards sd cards yes all size all models so we also got an extra backup 
SD card because we never know how many videos we're gonna mm. film. We're planning to blog and vlog about food, travel, excursions, yoga, everything, gear, lifestyle, literally everything. Mm -hmm. And so we need probably extra memory in our camera. Next is, so this is our main vlogging setup, really. So we have the M6, we have the wide angle, we have the B-roll lens, and, oh, I dropped it. <laughs> that is expensive. It's like a full workout. You can do two things in one. We might have to replace this. But anyway, so we have the land covered. Now we want to cover the ocean. If we want to go scuba diving, wherever, somewhere in Asia or Halong Bay or something. So we have the GoPro. This is only the GoPro Hero 5. We are planning to upgrade, but at this point, we really don't have a lot of finances anymore to upgrade, but we'll see later on, maybe. This is great for excursions, like Fabio said, for active vlogging in the ocean, in the water. You can go into the water with this, so. Yes, we're planning to do a lot of adventures, so that's mm -hmm. why we need something very small, yeah. something that doesn't break. And obviously, we have the holder holder my dad added this during my last trip in the philippines because we were scared that if i lose it i still at least i can put it in my wrist kind of like this so this is like a diy kind of it's kind of it look kind of look like ugly but it doesn't matter it's fine as it long as adjust. it serves the purpose purpose i'm yes. all about creating things on your on your own if you can Save make money. it work also when we vlog obviously we're not gonna have a tripod with us but we have this amazing handle uh, you can put it on the floor, you can wrap it around everything because this is very flexible. Mm -hmm. And also we use it as a handle. So we're just going to hold it like this. Like and on top of that, we also yeah, have perfect. this extra right here. It's just, a, this is the Manfrotto. This is the Gorilla Pod. The Manfrotto is great because it's just literally a handle like this. Just imagine a camera on top. But this is great if you don't have the wide angle lens. This is great because it gives you a little bit of extra yeah. Extra room. A little extension. Yeah. yeah. Also in our travel, of course, we are going to carry our phones. And we just decided, Yanni decided to upgrade to iPhone yes. 11. So you can talk about this because I, I'm not... So <laughs> I have the iPhone 11, you guys. And one of the reasons why I upgraded is because we are traveling next year. And my phone was literally busted. I came from iPhone 7. And what's great about iPhone 11 is it has the wide angle lens and that's literally the only reason why i got the iphone 11 and not the pro the pro has the telephoto lens but we don't need telephoto lens because exactly. you know and i've been traveling to montreal quebec with my family with my iphone 11 only without any camera with me so i've been vlogging with it i've been taking a lot of pictures with it and it's amazing the wide angle so do not underestimate your phone because there are situations where you you cannot you do you just don't want to bring your big cameras and you just want to carry light especially when you go for excursions like that the phone is always with you so you want to do not underestimate your phone even the lower iphone it can take great photos also i have my iphone 10 actually i just bought it last year and it works great camera is great everything mm -hmm. works perfect the memory in these two phones alone yes. is incredible we decided to buy the biggest memory there is we decided to include the phones in our travel gear because they are great travel equipment because you can use it to look for maps where you're going look for yeah. translation look for take pictures amazing and we just love apple products so apple if you want to sponsor us okay <laughs> <laughs> so no we love apple products so with that said we also have two macbooks um do you want to talk about yours first yeah so mine is an extremely old one but Guys, I'm impressed. I can tell I'm impressed you. with your laptop. It works so perfectly. I got mine in 2013. So it's the MacBook out. Air 2013, the first one. And Fabio has been editing videos in it, editing pictures. It works. Honestly, I mean, it's slow for me, but it works. I don't want to change it unless I really have to. Throwing this in a backpack, you don't even realize you have your because it's like laptop with mm -hmm. you. With that, I also have a MacBook, but mine is a MacBook Pro. This is the 13 inch MacBook Pro, the base model. I did not even upgrade anything. It doesn't even have the touch bar on top. This is a 2017 MacBook Pro. It can edit videos perfectly. It can head edit photos perfectly. So all my photography, all the vlogs that you see in this channel and our other channel are all edited in this MacBook and it works great. Do I wish it's a little bit faster? Yes, but it's not slow that will annoy me in the long run. Whichever of these two computers will work perfect. Any Apple product is perfect. I still have my MacBook that I gave to my dad 
since yeah. 2010. And it still works so it good. It still that works. One too. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. So also we have an amazing power bank, which charges a lot of stuff. It's multi-purpose. So this is multi-purpose. This is great. I've, I've had this for two years now. Oh, by the way, everything, most things you see here, we got from Amazon. So I got this from Amazon. It's a company called Anchor. So this is great because I've been traveling with this for two years and I've charged my phone. I can charge my phone three times or four times even and it will still not die. Look, it still has two bars and I've been traveling with it in Quebec City with my family for over a weekend for three days and I've been charging my phone with this and it did not d die. So with that said, our batteries from the main vlogging camera, like I said, it can be charged through USB so we can also charge it here, like I said. So now we have the land vlogging covered. We also have the ocean vlogging covered. Now we want to cover the air. So we have the Mavic Air drone. So I, this is my latest purchase. One of mo the most, a lot of this is expensive, one of the, but a, this is one of the most expensive purchase I've ever done this year. I got it in February. Um, it's amazing. It's light. I got the Mavic Air because it's light. Like I said, we want to travel light and it can fold. Look, it's literally a size of my phone when it's folded and it can fold to a very, very small size like this. And it's amazing because it takes full HD video. It also takes 120 FPS for great slow motion. And yeah, it's very light and compact. It's lighter than the lens. Oh, it's much lighter than the lens. That's it's much lighter sure. than the lens. Yeah, because so, it has to fly. Anyway, so we also have... There's two sets of this. I have two sets of wings, propellers extra, because I got the fly more combo. With the fly more combo, it comes with two extra batteries in the bag. We have the charger. So that's the drone, and I'm happy with that. I'm still learning how to fly, but I flew it once when I was in the cruise ship, and it was amazing. Also, because we'll be traveling the whole world, basically, or most of it, uh, we went for um, Universal adapter, which is gonna save our life. I know that. That's amazing. This is one of us, our latest purchase on Amazon. Again, Amazon. So, so everything is gonna link down below, mm -hmm. obviously. As you can see, look at it. It has US, UK, and Europe. So wherever we go in the world, I think we are covered. Since we have all this gear to charge, laptop, phones, camera, drone, GoPro, and three extra batteries, we got the extension cord this is amazing it's very small it has six ports outlets and it has four port usb c charging i mean usb charging ports use this whatever country we're in and then plug this in here and we can charge as many equipment as we can most likely we'll be able to charge basically everything at the same time through mm -hmm. this mm -hmm. and hopefully not catch on fire hopefully <laughs> so with all this data with all these videos with all the photos we also have an external hard drive this is only two terabytes actually two terabytes alive so i shouldn't say only Two terabytes of hard drive. We've been using this to back up and to edit off of our laptop and this. this so that's a combo of my editing. Um, the reason why I got the extra two terabyte external hard drive because MacBook Pros are hella expensive, especially when you upgrade the memory in them. So like I said, I we only got the base model, no upgrades or anything. That's why it's a lot cheaper when you get this because it's only $100 or something like that on Amazon. And this is great. You probably see this in a lot of travel vloggers or like YouTubers because this is like the ragged external hard drive. So you can drop it. It's supposed to be shock resistant and everything. Yeah, honestly, We're, it's yeah. really, really nice. We're planning to buy an extra just to back up. Yeah. all our data so we might purchase that later on this month last item in our gear all of this except for fabio stuff all of most of this has to somehow fit <laughs> <laughs> somewhere <laughs> somewhere but so this is our camera bag i'll be carrying this mostly fabio will have his another extra bag i'm not sure what bag you're gonna buy we don't know yet he's shopping looking around but this is our camera bag it's great because at the front You'll, you'll have your compartment for your laptop. It's only very, it's very skinny. So I have my iPad in there for now. At the back, it opens up to like the big co compartment. Ta-da! So as you can see, it's great because it has different compartments. You can put all your gear in there. So look, I still have the other set of wings. 
for my drone and just other photography stuff. I will clean this up later and I will fit everything in here. Good luck traveling through customs and security with all this gear. But it's not very yeah. massive gear. They're all small. And Honestly, it's incredible how everything, all this that you see laid down here fits in that backpack. You I've probably, seen it. You probably have to carry some of it. Yeah, I will carry a lap, probably my like laptop and uh, this I won't big one fit. probably because yeah. it will not fit. Most of this will fit in that camera, which is amazing to me. Anyway, so that's pretty much it for our travel gear. We're pretty, pretty much complete. We just need to purchase another one of this because I'm always scared to lose data. Yeah. So we have to back up regularly. All this costs probably $20,000. With this video, we wanted to cover our main gear and let you know what we're using for our editing and for our mm -hmm. travel. If you want to know how we made this travel possible without spending a fortune, then check out the previous video. Yanni created a special video on how to travel hack by using credit cards. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so comment below as well if you have any questions. Um, this is probably the most basic travel gear you can buy out there like our camera is not what famous travel vloggers or vloggers use because it's one of the cheapest and most most basic but it's, it works great it takes great videos and auto focusing is great so thank you so much for watching we we'll see you all in the next video bye